Hey guys, this week we're gonna talk about love. Not that kind of love. I just thought I would talk about a different kind of love. It is a sort of love that is also important, I think, and something that's been on my mind lately. When I first started making videos or got into animation and After Effects, I had this like urge to really know how things worked or like how to operate a camera or how to do certain things. I was motivated by that uh, thirst to want to know how to make things. And I feel like I've just got to a point now where I've settled. I'm like, yeah, I kind of know how to work with After Effects. I kind of know how to work with a camera, so I'm good. And that I, I just hate it and I don't want it to be like that. I want to learn. There's tons and tons and tons of things that I don't know, have no idea how they're done and that would be cool to know at least a little bit of. It, it was just such a cool feeling when I first had an idea and then I just felt like I needed to turn that into a video and I was just restless until I, I made that idea into a thing. And it was so cool, like, cool to get up in the morning and just have that feeling of like, I'm focused on this, I'm gonna edit. And I haven't really had that feeling in the past, I don't know, month, months, I don't know. <laughs> I kind of had to put myself in a different mindset and just, just be like, no, it's time for you to make things. What else are you gonna do if you're not doing the things that you like? Why procrastinate? Why postpone things? Why make excuses when I could be making things? that I'm proud of. So I think it's time that I take some time to do the things that I love, starting right now. <laughs> I don't know if I'm postponing things for fear or for any particular reason, but like, I think it's enough. So yeah, thanks for listening. Happy Valentine's. Go be with someone you love, but also go do things that you love. All right, I'll see you next week.